Rayburn understood the necessity of government to help people fight forces that were too big for them to fight themselves. Rayburn, I think, had a great deal of distrust of Wall Street and big business. He once said any town big enough to have a chamber of commerce wasn't worth it anymore. He was a Texas populist. He cared about the little guys. He was an admirer of Roosevelt. He thought that uh, Roosevelt was very brave to take on these financial barons in New York, the people who Rayburn believed had brought on the Great Depression. I think Franklin Roosevelt looked on him as somebody he could go to for help in getting legislation passed. He supported the New Deal enthusiastically. Many of the bills to regulate Wall Street came before Rayburn and his committee in the House. Wall Street had totally mobilized. He held hearings where sometimes he simply tore the representatives of big business apart.